Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to DIY Tuesday. We're really excited to have you guys here today. Um, I have some really fun things to share with you guys. First off, before we even start this video, I'm going to announce to you what our daily giveaway is. So this giveaway is going to end on Friday this week, but if you comment, you have the chance to win one Oil Life sticker book as well as an Oil Life sample clutch. Now this holds 10 bottles and it can hold the five milliliter bottles, it can hold the 15 milliliter bottles, and it holds the roller bottles. So it's a really great resource for traveling and it'll help you get where you need to go with your most essential oil, you know, combination in this bag. It is micro, uh, microwave, I'm so sorry, it's machine washable, which is really great and useful when you get it really dirty because it does have that white on it. So if you get it dirty, all you have to do is pop it in the washing machine, let it air dry, and you're ready to go again, which is really nice. So it is really portable and it's great as well as a sticker book. So make sure that you're commenting, liking, sharing this post because we will be doing that giveaway and it does end on Friday. So you still will have time after this video is over to enter. Um, just to let you guys know before we get started with this, the recipes we are doing are from the Autumn Lookbook. I'm really excited to announce that our holiday lookbook is coming soon and we're really excited for that one as well. You guys are going to love it. It's got some really cool things in there as well. Now, speaking of cool things, we now have daily deals going on, you guys. Our autumn sale is in full swing. It's the end of autumn sale and we have some amazing deals for you guys. Now, if you're not already signed up for our newsletter, that's okay. All you have to do is go to our website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and subscribe to our newsletter and we'll be sending you details on sales throughout the week. So you'll be able to stay up to date on what you have the opportunity to get at a lower per price. We do have products up to 90% off today, you guys. Today, tomorrow, it's through the rest of the week and into next week. Um, so we're really excited for that. Uh, we do have a couple of really quick announcements. We now have price matching on our website. So that means if you can find a price, a product that we sell on our website for cheaper somewhere else, you can submit that price to us and we will match it. Now if we can't, we'll give you a free Oil Life gift card. So make sure that you're matching those prices because we wanna make sure that you guys are getting the best value for your dollar. So make sure you're taking advantage of that offer as well. It is available on every product on our website. So, and that does exclude Amazon. So we do not count Amazon in that offer, but it is an amazing offer, you guys. So I challenge you to take advantage of that. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. So today we are making, again, the recipes from the Autumn Lookbook, and we are going to get started with the hand cleanser. Now this is really good, especially for this time of the season when, you know, there are germs going around and stuff. So you just kinda wanna give yourself that extra protection and you don't really wanna dry your hands out. This hand cleanser will keep your hands moisturized as well as germ free. So let's get started. I'm going to take the, um, I have this pump bottle from our website. It is, I believe, a dollar twenty or something like that. It's available on our website. It's a foam pumper. So this will be a foaming hand sanitizer, which is really nice for, it's just light and it doesn't feel heavy on your hands. So I'm just gonna take this bottle. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take one teaspoon of Castile soap. So I have this giant container. You can usually find them in a little bit smaller containers. Um, we just got a big one for the sake of all the DIY that we do here. So I'm gonna pour this in. And if you need to, you can use a funnel. I'm gonna do it just so that I don't get this mess everywhere. So it's just one teaspoon of Castile soap. And then I'm actually gonna take this out for right now because it is really big. And then we're going to take one teaspoon of aloe vera gel. So this is gonna help keep your skin feeling good after you put that on. After you put the hand sanitizer on, it's gonna keep your skin feeling soft and nice. So one teaspoon of this aloe vera gel. Pour that in that way. And then we're gonna do half of a teaspoon of vitamin E oil. This is also gonna help keep your hands um, moisturized and feeling great during the whole winter season when things do get dry and it is just kind of a sad month for skin. 
or sad couple months for skin, I'm sorry. All right, so we're gonna put that half a teaspoon of vitamin E oil in there. Okay, and then it's asking for 15 drops of protective blend. Now you can use more, you can use less, you can combine it with some things. Um, personally, I like protective blend and eucalyptus. I think they smell amazing together, but for today I only have on guard. So that's what we're gonna use. So I have this and we're just gonna do 15 drops. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna count because otherwise it's gonna be a bad situation. Perfect, okay. And then once you have all of those in there, you're just gonna go ahead and fill the rest of the way with water. Now I do recommend using a funnel for this one because if you're like me, I spill everywhere and it's just, it's a problem. So I'm just gonna go ahead and fill this. You don't have to fill it all the way because you do want to shake this um, once you're done with it, just to make sure everything's mixed up and ready to go. So I'm just going to put this lid. See, I filled it too far and I even used the funnel. What? Why? Um, okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to shake it and then you just pump it into your hand and it does come out like this. You only need one pump. It does a little bit, does go a long way. You're just going to rub it into your hands. It smells good, it feels good, and it doesn't leave a nasty feeling residue on your hands and your hands aren't going to feel dry. So it's really good for traveling, all of that. It's just, it's the perfect little fit in your purse and go kind of hand sanitizer. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the label from our Autumn Look book and I'm going to put it on the bottle. So if you haven't seen these labels, they are amazing and they super cute, really professional looking, and they'll give your DIY projects just that little edge of creativity. Now, I'm going to mention again, we are having a sale on daily deals that are available on our website. Now, if you go to the daily deals tab, they're all gonna be there. We have posted a schedule in our newsletter, so if you're subscribed to that, you'll get that as well. Um, just to let you know, on top of those daily deals, we still do have that Autumn 50 code that is available and still active. So that's $5 off any purchase of $50 or higher. So that's not gonna double, you're not gonna get 10 off when you purchase 100, but it is $5 off any purchase over 50. And we do have that free shipping on orders over $200. So it is a really good time to get your holiday shopping done for all of your oil loving friends and family. And we just have some really good deals on there, so go check it out. So our next recipe is going to be the um, dry shampoo. Now this one I love. I've actually used this quite a bit because it smells clean and it doesn't leave my hair with that nasty residue and it's, it, it's not gonna turn your hair gray. I'm gonna show you how to do that in a second. So what I'm gonna do actually before I do that is because I'm using a powder and I don't want it to get on the bottle and then not have the label stick, I'm actually gonna put the label on first. So I'm gonna find my dry shampoo label. I'm just gonna pop this right on the bottle. And if you guys do wanna do this for a DIY class, it is really simple and it's a cheap way to teach people about essential oils. You just have them bring their own products and oils and then you can make them together. It'll get people asking questions and it'll get people more comfortable with the idea of using essential oils in their other aspects of their daily lives. So. What I have is this bottle, so we're going to use, it's eight uh, tablespoons, I'm sorry, of arrowroot powder is the first um, part of this. So I already have that measured out. I am going to use my handy dandy little funnel again because as we saw before, I'm not the cleanest person when it comes to putting things in containers. So I'm just gonna dump this right in the funnel and you are going to need to shake this a little bit to get it to go through, but it does make for a little bit of a cleaner process. It does take a little bit more time, but in the end, it'll save you a lot of trouble. Now it is getting stuck because I did use the liquid from the previous um, project in here, but it is coming through. There we go, perfect. So I'm just gonna pour the rest of that in here. Awesome. Now, for those of you just joining us, make sure that you're commenting and liking because you will have the opportunity to win 
an oil life sticker book as well as a clutch today a travel clutch so make sure that you're commenting liking sharing those are each comment is going to count as one entry so make sure you're doing that for more chances to win now we i have the arrowroot powder in here and wow my hands smell really good i'm like smelling them as i move them and it's really cool anyways so i have the arrowroot powder in here now we're going to take half a teaspoon and you can adjust it according to what color your hair is but this cocoa powder it's just unsweetened cocoa powder and you can adjust it to how light your hair is. If your hair is white, go for it. Just use the arrowroot powder and the Melaleuca in here. That's totally fine. If you have darker hair, we do recommend using this um, cocoa powder just to darken it so it doesn't look like you have a film on your hair. So I'm just gonna take a little pinch because I have used that teaspoon measure for liquids again. So I'm just gonna pinch this. And I don't need a lot because I'm blonde. But if you have that darker hair, I recommend putting about half a teaspoon in there, just depending um, on what the color of your hair is. And you can do it to your preference, you know. And so then I'm just going to take my Melaleuca, and I'm just going to put five drops in. Super easy. So just one, two, three, four, five. Perfect. I did get six in there. We're going to be extra clean today. So... Then I'm just going to put the little shaker part back on here. Make sure it's on all the way. And then all you have to do is just shake the bottle to mix that cocoa powder and the arrowroot powder. Um, as you can see, mine still looks pretty white just because my hair is blonde, so I don't need that much dark color in it. Um, but like I said, for people with darker hair, it is good to use more cocoa powder. But you can do it to preference, and you can do it piece by piece just so that you have all of you know, it doesn't, it's not too dark or it's not too light. So just play with it a little bit. So there is the dry shampoo. It does work really well. It smells great. And it does have that little bit of cocoa smell in it. So you kind of, it smells like the holidays. It's great. It's awesome. Um, so we're going to move to our next and final recipe. So this is the success blend. Now this blend is, was created to kind of promote feelings of motivation and just kind of get you psyched to be doing whatever you're doing because sometimes when you're working or doing a tedious task it's kind of you just I don't really want to do this and so this is going to kind of help you get motivated and get to where you need to be so what we're going to do is I have my 10 milliliter bottle here and you guys I have to tell you keep your eyes out and subscribe to our newsletter because we have some really cool things coming up soon and roller bottles are one of them so make sure you're keeping an eye out for those. We do have that coming soon. I can't guarantee when it will be, but it is coming soon. So I have my 10 milliliter roller bottle and this is just a super simple, easy recipe. It's a great gift for somebody if you wanna just give it as a gift. Um, so it's just, it's three drops of lime. It's three drops of wild orange. Two drops of black pepper. And two drops of frankincense. And then you're just going to fill the rest of the way with fractionated coconut oil. Now, this does actually smell really good as a diffuser blend. Now, if you're going to use it as a diffuser blend, I would recommend not putting fractionated coconut oil in it because that will break your diffuser. Thicker oils tend to leave a residue and the coconut oil really does leave a film. So make sure that you're just putting the oils in your diffuser and not that coconut oil. All right, so I'm just gonna fill this the rest of the way with that fractionated coconut oil. And for any of these, you can really put the label on first and then do the recipe. Um, I just did it specifically with the powder just because I do, when I've done it before, I've gotten powder on the label and then it doesn't stick as well. So just for that sake, I did that. But so we're just gonna pop this little roller ball on here with this oil key tool. These are back in stock. You guys go check them out. They're on sale, I believe. They're in the daily deals tab. They should be. If they're not, they have just expired. But remember that that daily deals tab is timed. So if you see a little timer, just because you have it in your shopping cart doesn't mean that it's going to stay there. You have to check out in order for that to count because if your product is still in the shopping cart, in your shopping cart, and you haven't checked out, by the time that it expires, it is going to go away. And so 
we urge you guys to check out as soon as possible. Now I'm just going to use this and pop this right on, super easy, and then I'm just going to put the lid on, and then I'm going to go find my sticker again in the middle of this book, Success Blend. And it does look really good, these stickers are gorgeous. So just a quick recap, you guys, um, for those of you who weren't with us at the beginning of the video, we are having a special today. If you comment down below in this video, we are giving away one Oil Life sticker book as well as a blue clutch case. Now this case does hold five milliliter, 10 milliliter roller bottles and 15 milliliter bottles. So it holds all of it, it holds 10, of whatever you want to put in here if you want to put a mix in and you can still stuff a couple of things in the middle between that so it does make for a really great carrying travel case um, make sure you're commenting on that that will expire so we're going to be announcing the winner on friday now just to recap some of our other deals right now we are having our end of autumn sale going on that is going to go until next wednesday so we are having deals up to 90 percent off select products we do have a separate tab for that on our website. Go ahead and check it out. It's the daily deals tab on the main page. Don't forget that we have free shipping over $200 and you're going to get $5 off of $50 purchase or more with that code autumn 50. Now that is one word autumn 50 and 50 is five. Oh, not the actual word 50. Um, and you can look at that for reference on the back of your autumn lookbook. It is there as well. And also we are price matching now. So if you can find a deal or a product that we sell on our website for cheaper on another website, feel free to submit that to us. There is a button on next to each of the products. Now, when you click on it, that says price match and it'll pull up this whole other screen where you can price match and then we'll get back to you and we'll let you know if we can price match it or not. If we can't, we will send you a free oil life gift card. So make sure that you're getting as much money as you can out of your products and getting the best value possible. You guys, thank you so much for joining us for DIY Tuesday. We're really excited to see you at our holiday bazaar. That is in two days and we're so excited for that. If you haven't signed up for that, please, please do. It's going to be so fun. We are announcing that schedule tomorrow. So watch our Facebook page for that and it will go out in the newsletter. So make sure that you're subscribe to the newsletter and watching our Facebook page. You guys, thank you so much for joining and we will see you on Friday.